Hello beauties, welcome to my frozen inspired makeup look. I will be using the Tarte Amazonian Clay Foundation and in the lightest shade and placing it all over my face as well as blending it into the neck. Using my Bobbi Brown corrector, I will be concealing any dark circles I may have as well as brightening up the eye area. To reduce the shine, I will be using Neutrogena's Shine Control all over my face. To prime my eyelids, I'm using the Lorac Behind the Scenes Primer and just rubbing it all over and underneath my eye. Taking MAC Cranberry, I will be placing this all over the lid. Using Fig One, I will be doing a purple wash all over my lid. Next, take Blank Tight, and I will be using this to highlight under the brow bone as well as just clean up some areas. Taking the Wet n Wild Floral Values, I will be using that middle purple shade to wash over again. And using the pink, I will use it as a contour. With the Revealed palette from Coastal Scents, I'm taking the lightest silver shade and just placing on the inner corner and blending it out into the lid to give it a frosty look. Using Wet n Wild Diamonds Breezy, take some of the blue and just place it underneath the eyelid um, just to give it a frozen look. Take the Jordana 12 Hour Made to Last eyeshadow pencil in Eternal White and place that in the waterline. To create a cat eye look, I am using the Stila Stay All Day Liquid Eyeliner Pen. If you would like, use false lashes and don't forget to fill in your eyebrows with whatever you wish. I'm using the Lancome Hypnose Drama Mascara. And for blush, I'm using the Milani Bella Rosa on my cheeks and a little bit on my nose as well. For lips, I am taking MAC Plumful and mixing it with a little bit of the Bite Beauty Fig Lipstick. And there you have it. There is the Disney's Frozen inspired makeup look. Hope you enjoyed it. Bye.